uh, from the get-go, I knew that I needed help with Sumo. Uh, I did a ton of research, but that was clearly not enough. This is such a complex and ritualized and, and historical, long historical sport and religion. Uh, so we hired James Yagashi to help us with the Sumo component and then paired him with Chelsea Pace as our intimacy and also co-fight directors. And the two of them worked on making sure that the fights looked as real as possible, obviously without hurting the actors, but it wasn't, we wanted to make sure that the fights themselves told the story. So they weren't just um, set pieces within the main story, but that they were, continue. it's like a song in a musical, you know, you want a song to move along the story and not sort of stop the storytelling. That's the same thing. That's how we approach the fights, that they continue the story. The spiritual and the physical are sort of the opposing poles that shape the story of the play. It vacillates between the Shinto religion and the presence of gods from which Sumo originated and the very physical world of modern day Sumo fighting, which is basically pushing people out of that ring. <laughs> but I think the story va uh, you know, mo moves in and out of that fluidly and that is a, uh, one of its most interesting aspects, but also one of its most challenging.